in Matthew chapter 19 and in Mark chapter 10, the priest of the temple who ruled over doctrinal issues, of religious issues, come to Jesus and scripture says they came purposely to test him on a hard question. What question was that? It was about marriage. I've been pondering why would they choose no other topic but marriage? Because marriage is the first institution established by God after the church and that is where the enemy came to attack. Jesus does not mince words. Jesus tells them for this purpose a man shall leave Matthew 19 5 a man shall leave his father and mother and cleave to his wife and they become one flesh one flesh and then what strikes me is that the disciples of Jesus then tells Jesus if this is the case, because Jesus spreads out God's mind over marriage, over divorce, etc. Because they come, they came to ask Jesus a question about divorce. But if you read the whole of Matthew chapter 19, it's about marriage, family, children. And every place you read, the disciples are struggling to come to the concept of family, of marriage, of children, and God's view. We would attempt to ex explore this very hard theological question because I recognize that after Jesus left, the apostles who said to Jesus after him, discussing God's mindset of marriage for them, told Jesus, if this is the case concerning marriage, then it is not good to marry. Now, Paul, Jesus says the two shall be one. Paul comes and says, no, the man is the head and the woman is forever. This tells you and I that we all struggle to come to the concept of God for marriage. It is not about one being the head and one being the tail, but becoming one flesh. And it is a mystery. My guest in studio is no other person than my husband, who is well equipped with premarital um, and family therapy well equipped with premarital counseling all through the years this is one of his best field and i'm glad that he's going to take us through today in dating courtship our uh, christian dating courtship and transitioning into marriage the diana adu royal global ministries and missions presents apostle nana Bini in a discourse themed before you say i do dating, courtship and transitioning into marriage on Sunday 21st of August with a rebroadcast on Wednesday 24th of August 2022. Streaming live from 8 to 9 p.m. BST on the Good News TV, that's www.goodnewstv.org.uk. On Facebook slash the Diana Adu Royal Global Ministries and Missions and on YouTube slash the Diana Adu Ministries and Missions Official. Don't miss.